Okay, most medical professionals are no doubt committed to caring. A new at 10 tonight team's Jennifer Hoff met a group about to travel 2,000 miles to prove it. Jen? Well, out of the 11 people, at least half of them are St. Mary's Hospital nurses, and one will take her first trip to a country ravaged by an earthquake nearly four years ago. On January 12, 2010, an earthquake rocked Haiti. And it was just this immense roaring. Madison nurse Jennifer Weitzel was there on a mission trip she'd already been making for five years. That was what was more startling to me than even the shaking. News 3 interviewed her then and now about her commitment to a community that just keeps growing. You know that what you're giving her is going directly to the people. Longtime St. Mary's nurse Peggy Weber is making the trip for the first time and will join 10 others to provide, in part, medicine. We'll be seeing 100 people a day in these clinics that are set up outside of the city. Weber will even teach a new nursing class to Haitian students and help build a clinic that could open next year. The group also gives out dresses to orphans from Wisconsin parishioners. She helps some older ladies get their old singers out, their old singer sewing machines out, and get them going again, and they actually made the dresses too. The number of children at the orphanage has doubled since the quake, and cholera continues to pop up in the population. But so do Jennifer Weitzel and her volunteers, who are trying to spread good in a place filled with so much bad. You're going to see so much need, and you're going to feel so sad, and you're going to feel so guilty for what you have, and you're going to feel like you, you, you're not doing anything. But anything that you can do, will be important. And as long as you do it with love, it'll be perfect. Nurse Peggy leaves with uh, part of the group this weekend. They paid their own way and will be gone for 10 days. And when they return, that's when the next group will go. If you want to help, we did put a link to the nonprofit that they're working with on channel3000.com. And uh, we already are uh, planning a, a follow-up story here because I think it will be important to hear how the trip went and how things are going in Haiti. Yeah, absolutely. They need so much help down there. It's amazing that they've yeah. committed to that. Thanks, Jen. Yep. Thanks, Jen.